Uh, how y'all doing? On my way home, but gonna go to GameStop by my house, pre-order Pokemon Arceus because I don't know, I didn't watch some early gameplay of it on YouTube, and I'm like, I want that shit. Most early gameplay you find is normally a, uh, you know, beta tested or a down version of the game. Because normally when a game comes out now, there's always like a like a release patch update for it when it comes out. So, you know, definitely gonna uh, enjoy it. I like the way it looks so far. And once they update it, there'll be some, pretty sure some new shit they can do to it. I know it's kind of rare for y'all to see me do uh, videos during the daytime like this. But something I want to talk to y'all about, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you have seen it on Instagram, maybe your Facebook, I don't know, but especially Instagram, and the news of a guy who was riding 134 miles per hour on a street and decided to crash or ended up crashing into a car that was turning left going 134 miles per hour body lifted in the air crash some people say he died on impact i believe he died on the impact when he hit the ground because he got launched in the air first but from what i hear that's enough force to kill somebody as soon as the impact that's why he flew off you know he was running from the cops and the cops didn't pursue him supposedly supposedly he pursued him a little bit and they're like no we're never gonna follow the dude there's no way and it's when they're killing himself pretty much i'm so hot but it was kind of cool this morning still the buy was it really worth it and you know this makes the feelings about it some people are like oh he got what he deserves and some people are saying oh well a life is a life though why are you so negative that's jacked up what do i stand with it i ain't saying shit about it because in my opinion he shouldn't have stole the bike. Should have been running from the cops. Should have been riding safe. Or just should have really stole the bike in the first place. He said, fuck you, bro. You take it too long. Nigga, okay, you're more than welcome to length, but all you want. I want to live. Damn, look, he's way over there. Yeah, that's right. I hear my ass coming. I ran patrol. I ran patrol. There it goes, I feel it. It's supposed to be like 30 to 35 mile per hour winds. I'm like, ooh, that's kind of strong. And I know my bike's not liking this. My gas now is getting this kind of oil looking I'm flying in the damn wind. Do y'all ever get this feeling that a car is gonna like fucking merge or something? So you kind of like slow down, you just feel it. I'm not saying it'll happen, but just, just in case. There's an old lady in the car. I wonder why she didn't get out. Get it, old dude, get it. Or, elderly. He might not like to be called old. to move when it's safe bro I have to right away when you're turning anywhere you're supposed to yield and turn when it's safe I have a straight line there's no light and it's legal for me to lace with
Well, hope you guys enjoyed that little video. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.